Hello to you. We are going to make a little overview and overview of Arch Merged XFCE. This is what you're looking at. So we have installed a lot of things already and this is the end result. So you start off with Arch Merged with a D. That's an ISO that's minimal. You don't have anything, no desktop, no theme, no icon and so on. Then you install uh, scripts or you, you run scripts and the fun in scripts is that it's actually just text. If you want to say, I don't want Firefox, just put a hashtag in front or delete the line. Or you do want to have another um, application that's not in the script. You just copy paste and tape the, type the name of your application and it's in there. So you're free and that's Linux. It's freedom of choice. You can choose any distro, you can choose any application, any theme, any icon. It's up to you. It's your choice. So we want to provide you with an, an ISO that's free. You have Arch Linux on your system and then it's up to you. Do I decide to take XFCE? Do I decide Budgie i3? And we'll have plenty more um, uh, desktop environments in the future. All right, so what did we do? What uh, is this thing here? We have the wallpaper that's a bit obvious here, a little nice uh, chicken here. And we have that because of Variety. So Variety has here been installed. You can select in here whatever you like. You're free. That may be a good thing to keep because, well, yeah, it's Linux. You're free to choose the distro. You're free to choose the theme and so on. What else do we see? We see Plank and we've installed the Arch Merge uh, choices. And there are lots of Arch Merge choices. And it's up to you to decide what goes well with your team at the moment. So it's a dark team. We can keep a dark background or just say, no, I want to have a white background instead. We can zoom it like so or not. It's all about choice and you just choose and set it right. The next thing that's obvious is this thing up here and that's the conkey. So we have in Arch Merge without D, we have a conkey. And, and, and I've learned that maybe it's more interesting in XFC to have it in the right mouse click. Why not? So at this point in time, we'll probably make it later. There's no reference in here because frankly, you have to look and go and go over that. So right mouse click up and there you have the conky Zen and select it. So you can click it here. So it's alphabetically AM, AM, AM and so on, as you can see. Let's take something different. Uh, by the way, this is a Lua um, script that's running, meaning dials, clocks and, and all these things. That's um, a specific kind of way to show information. And that's why it says Lua. So in the scripts, you'll install, you'll uninstall the Conkey and reinstall a Conkey with uh, well support for the Lua things. So I'm going to take something maybe orange. So color is important. Design for us is important. So we want to have a an, 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 an desktop that really looks awesome in all the ways, in all elements. That's the fun in, in Linux. You can change anything here. Okay, so now we have a new conkey, the wallpapers, the plank, and we have here a toolbar. And the toolbar of XFC is normally, normally on top. So we've changed it and we've changed also the menu. This is the whisker menu because I like it more because we can go over it like this. And one of the things I like it for is because sometimes we just want to, you don't know the name, but we want to print or you, you just want to browse and then you get an information list. You get all, all a selection and that's helpful. That's helpful in the beginning. So we have also these very important buttons where everything is at. So this, uh, this information is available very soon down here and not up there or, or something like that. So we've changed the menu, we've made it transparent, a nice little icon up here. It's all taken care of and we've made a link to Arch Merge Hello. I do notice that people still don't know, but this is the place for you to go to. This is the this is the link actually. You can go to archmerch.information info. And then we have four websites, guys. Four. Forum, ask away. Archmerch.com is for the big ISO. 
an arch merged is for the small eye, so the minimal eye. So that's this one. That's what the one. That's the one we're using. So at this moment, I'm writing here. I'm writing articles on XFCE. So this is the first video I'll make and post. This is arch merged XFCE gallery. This is what we're doing. All right. Take a look at all the pictures. We'll ha add more in the future, and at some point in time, you'll give us some screenshots and then we'll put it in the gallery here as well so this one this movie is going to replace that one so that's how it works you get all the information you go here arch merged info this is where you switch between websites a little bit different difference in color and um, that should be enough to tell you that you switched um, so here's the download button and of course if you'd like to donate because we're actually you're actually at school, you're actually at university. We teach you a lot of stuff. And if you say, hey, I appreciate this, this effort uh, these guys do, then donate and we'll get uh, more uh, future. We can have more future plans, you know, vision of what can we do financially to the, in the future. All right, um, so that's, um, that's that. So we've changed all of that, the panels and um, no, that's it. We have here this red thing. I will include it in this in this video as well. So just click here, apply. That's that. Or uh, there is also this one, Control Alt T. Oh, that's something I forgot to tell you. So if you're a user of Arch Merch, then you know that I love my shortcuts. I am also an i3 user, and that's really keyboard shortcut driven. So all the shortcuts are in here. So super return. And super shift return the ones from i3 they're all working so I do not tend to think but my fingers know already what to press so they're in there and um, I wanted to say that there are some of the aliases here not all of them but some of them are and for instance this updating thing that red thing down there and can be done with this one as well it's the a stands for the AOR so we can update our packages and then also the A from AOR, and everything will be updated as, uh, at once. Do check what will be updated, that's important to know what's going to, going to change on your system. In this case it's not that major, it's just an update for Chromium, which is here. So, <coughs> well, with Alt to arrow to the right, I get this image, Alt F to the right, etc, etc. So these are my shortcuts that are still in in here this is more for Susan so I'll skip ahead <laughs> let's go on holiday so this is how it works this is a variety showing me all the pictures I think I guess we've um, given you an overview if you like what you see then you can uh, start installing arch merged and then we're going to install uh, XFCE and explain you all the bits and pieces I've done I've, I've set to get to this result. All right, cheers.